Hey guys, we were working on writing sentences. We had two sentences and we were working on our letter of the week, the letter X, and we used our chart, our word chart with the letter X, and we also used sight words. We made a couple of sentences and I created them this time since I didn't have you to help me out. We're going to go over those two sentences, write one more sentence, and then go back and do some things with these sentences. So let's go over the two sentences that we um, already wrote. Let's look real quickly at our board. I can't put everything up here right now. So this was our chart that we made with our letter X and you could print these out and you could have your own chart too and you could write the words next to it. And then we have our sight words and today I made those sight words. You have this in your book bag. Um, I kind of grouped them by their color. So you can see that we have the orange, yellow, green, or blue, and I'll often refer to it as a blue sight word or a yellow sight word. It just gives us one more way um, to remember it and find it. All right, so our sentences yesterday were, I will mix the wax. And then we read it like a first grader. I will mix the wax. Then we had, Dad can fix my tux. And then we read it like a first grader. Dad can fix my tux. All right, one more sentence today. The sentence is, look at the little fox. We're not writing yet. Look at the little fox. Let's count the words on our fingers. Look at the little fox. Five words. We're still getting that in our head. If you try to write it too soon, you lose it. Look at the little fox. One more time, say it with me. Look at the little fox. All right, I'm going to give you some clues here. Look at the little fox. Look at the little fox. Is look a word you know how to spell? It's not? Must be a sight word then. Look is a sight word. We look here. Guess what color it is? It's the color green down here at the bottom. Look. L-O-O-K, look. L-O-O-K, look. How do you spell look? L-O-O-K, look. L O O K look. I used a capital or a red letter here to start look. If we were doing this at school, I would probably go back and edit that later and do it later so it's not too many things to think about. Look at the little fox at can you sound that out at so a a t t if we're not finding those letters you want to grab your alphabet chart and point to them and find them that way look at the, T-H-E, the, that's our first sight word we learned in kindergarten. The, T-H-E, the, look at the, T-H-E, the, look at the, little, do you know how to spell that? Little, mm hmm. Is that a sound out word? 
Nope, it's a sight word. So little, little. This is a blue sight word. Little. L-I-T-T-L-E, -T -T -E, little. L-I-T-T-L-E, little. We just have to memorize it. L-I-T-T-L-E, little. L-I-T-T-L-E, little. Look at the little fox. Fox is a sound out word, and it also came from our chart. Fox. Fox. Let's sound that out. Fox. Fox. Look at the little fox. This is a sentence. A sentence begins with a capital letter that we also call a red letter. And it ends with a punctuation mark. Most sentences end with a period. We will talk more about question marks and exclamation points later. But this is a sentence. I need to see the end of it. So I put a period here at the end. Look at the little fox. All right, we have our three sentences. Now let's go back and look deeper. If the sentence is a sight word, we're going to put a blue box around it. You could pause this right now. If you don't have blue, you can just put a box around it and try to find all the sight words. You could pause that and try to find all the sight words. Let's see if I can get it a little bit closer. All right, here we go. I, is I a sight word? Make sure. Is I a sight word? I is a sight word, so we'll put a box around I. Will, is will a sight word? It sure is, so we'll put a box around will. Mix. Is mix a sight word? No, you can sound it out. The. The is definitely a sight word. It was our first sight word. T-H-E, the. Wax. Wax is a sound out word. Look at the wax. So we have boxes around those. All right, now we're going to look at the next sentence. Dad can fix my tux. We're going to put a box around the sight words. Is dad a sight word? No, you can sound that out. Can is a tricky one because you can actually sound it out. But we did learn it as a sight word. So you can either put a box around it or call it a sound out one. That one's special. Fix. We can sound that out. My. My is a sight word. It's a yellow sight word. Tux. Short for tuxedo. That's a sound out word. Next sentence, look at the little fox. Let's find the sight words. Look, look is a sight word. At, we can sound that out. At, the, sight word. Little, sight word. Fox. Ox. That is also a sight word.
In our alphabet, we have some very special letters. We have vowels. Our vowels are yellow on our alphabet chart. Our vowels are, I'm gonna use lowercase here, A, E, I, O, U. That's very light. What are our vowels? A, E, I, O, U. Every single word has a vowel. Sometimes Y can be a vowel. That's a first grade thing to learn. Every single word up there has a vowel. Can you find all the vowels? Circle all the vowels with a purple crayon or marker or just circle them. I won't go through the whole thing, but you could do that. Or you would go, oh, I is actually a vowel. And will, I is a vowel. And mix, I is a vowel. And the, E is a vowel. And wax, A is a vowel. You could, here's some extensions. Finish that up and you can turn this into a math lesson by counting how many A's did you have? How many E's did you have? How many I's, how many O's, how many U's? You could add that up. You could also see our letter of the week, the consonant X, how many X's were there? You could also find the letter of the week um, in each word and look for rhyming words. Lots of extensions you could do there. All right, that was writing sentences. I'll see you guys soon.